Okay. This little package right here is a camping chair, believe it or not. Pretty small, as you can see. Has a carry handle, zipper on this side. Very, very small, but yet it's a full size chair for an adult. I'm going to put it together so you can see what it's like. So, this is a little bit different than other camping chairs. Our other camping chairs are those kind that just, you know, fold up and then they come in a long bag with one side open and a drawstring. So this is a little different. It's smaller, it's lighter weight. It comes in a completely sealed bag, which is a great idea because how it is now, we keep our chairs in the shed outside. And when we need to get one, I have to send my husband out to get it because of course, spiders, and I don't know if spiders have crawled inside the bag because it's not very well sealed. So my husband's the one that has to go uh, get the, chair and then air them out to make sure there's no spiders in them but with these because it's a bag that's completely enclosed with a zipper i can get them myself maybe that's not a concern for you but that's the first thing i thought of when i saw this chair so um so the the bag has directions on how to set up the chair you don't really need it so it comes in this jumble of holes and um, that are connected with bungee cords or pieces of elastic. I don't know if you can see that. And then you just slide them in place. It's really easy because the, everything's connected with the cords. So you can never make a mistake as to where a certain pole goes. Okay, so here's the base of the chair. Very lightweight, I can hold it with one arm, no problem. So these two longer poles are the back and then the front poles are the front. So now I'm gonna show you how to put on the chair. You have to put the chair on, uh, the cover on in the right order and I'll show you why in a minute. So the first ones that go on, oops, are these two bottom ones. So there's a little pocket that the ends go into and you just stretch it over and put it in the pocket like that. And then it also has in the front of the chair between your legs, there's a little pocket and it looks like it's meant for a, a can of pop or a can of beer and then I don't know what that one would be for. I don't know why in the world they decided to put it here and not on the side. I guess I should just be happy they included it, but it's kind of weird placement. So then next you're gonna put on the back ones and they have these little orange loops. And the reason why they have the orange loops is because these are the ones you put on last. And the orange loops you hold onto with your hand and then it's easier to stretch it onto the pole. If you try to do these last, it's gonna be a lot harder. So. Just do the back ones the last. Okay, so here it is. The whole chair, it's all set up. This chair is also a swivel chair. So it turns just like one of those swivel office chairs. Uh, very comfortable, it's got a low back. So I'm gonna sit in it and show you what it's like. So there it is. The, the only really dumb thing is that they put the a little bag here. It really should have been on the side right here. I have no idea why they did it that way. Uh, but it swivels, it's very sturdy. It can hold a full size adult, such as myself. Um, really nice, really easy, pretty comfortable. You can kind of rock in it this way. I don't think it's meant to do that though. Um, but here's the back, so that's how far it will go up on the back. But really great chair, um, very lightweight, very compact, and of course I'm a fan that it's completely enclosed in a zipper case. So uh, very nice chair.